Hey everybody, Brad Hussey here. Thanks for checking out my video. I wanted to create a super short little tutorial video for you guys to show you how to set up a domain and hosting account with Just Host. Why Just Host? Because they're the best. But seriously though, let me tell you why they're actually the best. Because I've been using these guys for years now. I've never had a problem with them. I've always loved their customer service. It's been super fast. If I've ever had any questions or confusions, I just do the online chat support or I call them up and literally easiest thing ever. I've never had a problem with that. So there's that. Also, you get unlimited gigabytes of space. You get unlimited domains on your hosting account. You have unlimited email accounts and there's an anytime money back guarantee. But by far my favorite feature of Just Host's hosting package is their super easy one-click WordPress install. You literally can sign into your hosting account and set up a WordPress blog in minutes, maybe even faster. So from beginning to end, you can sign up for a domain and hosting package, install WordPress, write a blog post and post it live on the internet in under five minutes. It's wild. And to top it all off, the plans start at $3.95 a month. That's crazy. That's like a latte a month for wicked awesome hosting. So instead of just telling you why you should sign up for Just Host, let me show you why you should sign up for Just Host. All right, so let's get started. Now, the first thing I want you to do is navigate yourself to bradhussey.ca slash just host, or you can click on the button here in the video, or alternatively, you can click on the link in the description below this video. The reason why I want you to use this link is because it's my affiliate link. And to be totally transparent, all that means is at no extra cost to you, I get a signing bonus when you purchase a hosting package from just host. Now, like I said, it doesn't cost you anything extra. And it's kind of like, think of it as a tip. You tip me for providing you a super great service and a quality uh, tutorial, but it doesn't cost you anything. It's literally a free tip. So you can use my affiliate link if you want, which is bradhussey.ca slash just host, or you can just go to just hosts website on your own. And that's totally fine. No hard feelings. All right. So now you should be at just hosts homepage and it's very easy to see where to start. All you need to do is click on the big red button that says get started now. All right, so you should now be at the first step of the sign up process and you will be congratulated for making a smart decision. What you're gonna to wanna to do now is either select the first option, which says please register a new domain name for me, in which case if you don't have a domain name and you want one, Just Host can do that all for you for free, which is awesome. But if you already own your own domain name, all you need to do is choose the second option. I already own my no domain name, transfer clients, and then type in your domain name right there and then hit the blue button that says continue. Now you should be at step two. And all you need to do here is add your contact information, first name, last name, email address, so on and so forth. Enter your payment information. You can use credit card, PayPal, or a prepared order. Now, if you scroll down, you could see your order summary, and then you're going to need to choose an account plan. You can choose anywhere from one month all the way up to 48 months, and uh, that ranges in costs. But the longer the plan, the less the cost per month. And then below that, you will see something that says great deals on hosting essentials. All of these things are total options. They're not required for you to sign up. You could choose your site backup pro, and it's an extra $1.67 per month. Uh, that lets uh, Just Host kind of take the worry out of backing up your website, your databases, and all that sort of stuff. It's up to you if you want to choose this or not. Same with SiteLock. It protects your website from identity theft, fraud, spyware, all that sort of stuff. It, it makes it seem a little scarier. Um, you can do whatever you want here. You could choose SiteLock. You cannot choose SiteLock. It's totally up to you. If you have a high traffic website or you're going to be selling stuff, maybe this is a good option. But if it's, maybe, if it's just a blog and you're just going to be talking about your travel experiences or something like that, maybe you don't need this sort of thing. This uh, last option, search engine jumpstart, this is something maybe I would uh, recommend against. Not because it's bad, but you don't necessarily need to do this. This is something that you could do manually yourself. If you're blogging regularly, that's also a good thing for SEO. You can find free tutorials on um, the internet, on YouTube, even my tutorials. 
Um, so this is something that maybe I, I would recommend against just to save you an extra 15 bucks a year. After that, at the bottom, you'll see your total and then hit the red button that says complete. You might then be taken to another page that uh, is kind of an upsell page and it's all options. You don't need to use you don't need any of these things they are simply upgrades. So migration services, quick start coaching, additional domain names, so on and so forth. Again, I don't think you need to have these. You can read through the descriptions and if it's something that you think you want, then great. Uh, if you have any questions, honestly, just shoot me an email, send me a comment in the, in the description be below this video. Um, I'll do my best to get back to you and help you out because like I said, I, I stand behind this service. I've been using it now for seven years and I've directed hundreds and hundreds of people to this service. So just, you know, ask me and uh, I'll do my best to help you out. All right, so now let's just say that you have either chosen to go ahead with some of these upgrades or you chose not to go ahead with some of these upgrades. That's totally fine. After that, and you've completed your purchase, you should then get an email in your inbox with the login information, FTP information, all that sort of stuff uh, regarding your hosting plan. What you should definitely save that email put it somewhere in a folder or print it out or save it on your computer because it, it has important information such as your login info, your FTP info, and everything like that. That's good information for you to have in the future. Say if you hired a web developer or something like that and they needed your FTP to log in and uh, do some custom web development on your site, upload their files, things like that, you're going to need that FT FTP info. So keep that file or email rather. All right, and then after that, you can either click the link in your in your inbox to go to your uh, Just Host control panel, or you can navigate yourself to my.justhost.com. Once you get to this page, you will be at the account login, and that email that I mentioned just a moment ago should have your login information. You can log in using your username that Just Host provided you, or the domain say you uh, bought myfavoritewebsite.com, then you could put myfavoritewebsite.com and then enter your password. And then hit login, and now you'll be in your control panel. And so there's a whole bunch of stuff you can do in here, but I'm gonna save that for some later tutorials. But what I wanna focus on is how to install WordPress in one click. It's super awesome. So all you need to do is just scroll yourself down to the section that says Website Builders and you will see in that website builder section, WordPress. So go ahead and click on WordPress. All right, so now you should be in a section called the Mojo Marketplace. And in here is where you can install WordPress. So all you really need to do is just click the green button that says start a brand new install. Once you've clicked on that, you'll be directed to a second step which uh, allows you to choose which domain you would like to install to. Now, if your hosting has multiple domains like myfavoritewebsite.com, bradhusseyswebsite.com, so on and so forth.com, and yada, 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 etc., etc., then you can choose which domain you want to have WordPress installed to. Now, if you just have one domain, then you don't need to choose anything. You just choose the default option. And then the directory is where you would like that. Um, copy of WordPress installed. So let's say you have a section in your website that you want to have WordPress installed. So say wowbest.com slash blog. Then you can have WordPress installed there. But if you want your website itself, so wowbest.com to be the blog, then leave this as is, leave the directory empty then go ahead and click check domain and that's just going to check to see if you if, the, if there's anything else installed in that location that WordPress will need to overwrite and then you'll have another step that will say last step you're almost there you can choose to show the advanced options or just straight up install now the advanced options look like this and right there you can change the site name or title you can change your admin username so instead of maybe the email that's on file you can put something like um, WordPress underscore administration or something a little bit more um, harder to guess because there are people that might try and hack into the site and if you use a generic admin username like admin 
then there's a higher chance that someone might be able to brute force into your website. So use a, a harder to guess username, could be your email, could be something else, change your password, and then leave automatically create a new database for this installation, and then hit, well, check off, I've read the terms, and then hit install now. All right, and so after you've hit install, you will be taken to a progress page where you can see how far along the installation is. It might take a couple minutes. And after that, you should receive an email in your inbox from Mojo Marketplace, and that will have your URL, the admin URL, the username, and the password so you can log into your WordPress installation. So go ahead and do that and navigate to the admin URL. So you can click on that and you'll be taken to a login screen that prompts you to enter your username and your password. So go ahead and do that. And so then you'll be taken to your WordPress dashboard, which looks like this. And in order to write your very first blog post, go ahead and hover over new at the very top of the page and click on post. And here is the add a new post page. Go ahead and add yourself a new title for this blog post. And also add the content of your blog post because that's obviously important. Cool, and then when you're done, all you gotta do is hit publish on the far right hand side of your screen. Once you've done that, then your blog post will be published on the web, live on the internet. And all you need to do to, to view the post is just navigate to your website's uh, blog URL or hit view post in the very top of the website. And boom, that's it, live on the web, your very first blog post in no time. So with that being said, that's really it. That's how easy it is to set up your very first website or blog using Just Host. You can do it all in one go in literally five minutes. I mean, it might take you a little longer if it's your first time, but it really is super easy and it's cheap. It doesn't cost very much at all. And like I said, I totally recommend this service. I've been using these guys for seven years now and I recommend them to all my clients and my students and even my family members. So trust me when I say that this is a super great service and I stand behind that. If you have any questions about them, if you have any concerns or you need to know something about how to do something, just let me know and then I'll, let, I'll try my best to help you or even better, I'll create a tutorial video on your questions so I can publish that for free on YouTube so everyone out here can uh, benefit from that. So thanks for checking out my video. I super appreciate it. If this video has added value to your life, if it's helped you out in any way, I would super appreciate if you could share it with your friends, tweet it on Twitter, on Facebook, Google+, send the email to someone, share the video, whatever you can do would be awesome. And if you are gonna go ahead and set up your first blog and buy hosting with Just Host, and you decide to use my affiliate link at bradhusty.ca slash Just Host, then Thank you so much, I super appreciate it. And if you don't want to, then that's totally fine. But again, thanks for checking out my video. I appreciate your time and you're awesome. All right, cheers. Mm -hmm.